Oh, all right. First and foremost, so we're going to say all praises be to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Kadosh. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Moonstone. And Shalom to the sincere elect. You know, I'm the brother Shakao and Isaiah. Yeah, and then basically, we're just doing some, you know, uh, we're just reading some information and, and watching some videos on this uh, 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 pagan festival, which is, you know, Christmas, man. Christ Mass. And, you know, you know, in these bugged out churches and Roman Catholic churches and such things, people try and teach, you know, that's 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 the uh, Lord's birthday. And and that simply isn't the actual case. You know, if you go into research and a lot of into history it is it, 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 it's, it's a straight up a, a, a pagan feast and festival you know you know it's, it's you know it, you have a Saturnalia and also solar Invictus which is you know which means that the uh, the, 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 the sun is on unconquered you know and it was it was basically a, a pagan feast week, you know what I'm saying? You know, which sprang from what did they say it's what what the the December the seventeenth to the twenty third, and later it, it, it got then established on the twenty fifth. But it's straight up a uh, paganism, you know. And, and now, uh, like even like now, like especially now, you know, we're in a t time period of death. Right of, of plagues and pestilences, the lockdowns and shutdowns, but, but there's still people like in that spirit of mirth, man. You know that Christmas spirit, mirth, and it's straight up. It's against the scriptures. It's paganism. Have you got anything you want to say, bro? Uh, I got a scripture for you. Can't go, bro. A real quick one. Uh, this is Acts chapter eleven and twenty-six. It says, "And when he had found him, he brought him unto Antioch, and it came to pass that a whole year." They assembled themselves with the church and taught much people. And the disciples were called Christians first in Antioch. Come You know, so, 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 so really, the uh, true Christians are, are the uh, disciples of the uh, Lord, man, which uh, means uh, anointed ones, you know, and, 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 and really true. Christianity is 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 a really this true faith, man, and it's true truth. But you know, if you go go into what you know, people out there call Christianity and and church and stuff, it's straight up just pa uh, 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 pagan uh, rituals that's totally against the uh, scriptures, right? Which you know, which even includes this. And then even that that uh, scripture, you know, as well proves that the true Christians are are, are are the Israelites, man. That actually, you know, have this faith, right? Go on, bro. Uh, and as know, well, if you wanted to make a point on that scripture, you can speak on it. Yeah, no, because I was just gonna say, you know, like you got these uh, Christians in the Christian church. You know, they all say, oh, you know, you know, we're the Christians, we're Christians, but mm. really. You know they don't follow anything that the scriptures actually say. Mm -hmm. You know you, you got uh, Esau, the so-called white man. You know he'll hold the Bible up and you know make it seem like he he's so righteous and he follows the laws, but mm. he's the one that exalts the you know customs of you know uh, you know paganism, the paganism. You know and all this uh, witchcraft. You know which uh, all these things have uh, roots going back to Babylon. Mm. You know uh, the Christmas tree. Yeah, Rome. You know, yeah, Rome. Yeah, but even on the point on, 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 on Christmas tree, that's based on Nimrod, man. You know, that's straight up based upon, upon Nimrod. And even, you know, that's mentioned in Jeremiah 10th chapter. But even before we, before we do that, we can even go into some uh, uh, information there. Do you mind being out on down, bro? Yep, so it says what the Bible says about Christmas tree. All right, BibleTools.org. It says... And it's funny, these, these are so-called Edomite Christians, they actually go and research, you know, such information. But, but, but these two for Jake Coon, you know, I'm just doing it, I'm doing it for the kids, yeah. you know? Just, just that simple mentality. 
but it's straight up a, 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 a paganism. So that's why even it says in um, what's that um, Isaiah uh, 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 sixty that you know, you know that these people are covered in darkness, man. You know they're actually covered in straight darkness, like they're actually doing like now. A paganism is everywhere, like you know, like like, like all these uh, 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 doctrines, you know, the, 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 the LGBTQ and and such things. That's your witchcraft and paganism, but it's basically pushed forth upon people as light. You know, it's actually uh, uh, what's that scripture? Can you can you get it quickly? Um, Isaiah, what's it? Five and and twenty. Oh yeah, the I got that for you. And then I think there's one in Isaiah ten, good evil. Yeah, yeah, I'll get this one. This this is Isaiah five and twenty. It says, Woe unto them that call evil good. Yeah, and a prime example is Christmas. It's straight up, it's witchcraft, it's paganism, it's evil. But it's called as good, you know? Because even if you go into the information as well, you know, which, which you're going to get. Man, during, during, during that period, there was all kind of like OGs, oh, sex, and, and pedophilia, uh, and sacrifice human sacrifice that actually took place but but now it's just you know and and, and really you know if you as well as as we was going into the information if you go into the different aspects of it like the the the, the, the evergreen uh tree the uh mistletoe and such things the uh the you log right there's there's actually so much different uh types of well i say uh, uh, like a uh, uh, paganistic doctrine that's all just it's, it's basically a stirring point yeah you know, that whole <laughs> the, the whole spirit of christmas is just a whole stirring point of of paganism you know that's made one you know and and really the uh, the if you go into the research as well the uh Early church um, uh, fathers basically <laughs> included a uh, paganism to to to, 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 to basically uh, uh, so called try and like convert people that were in that 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 that, that uh, uh, paganist lifestyle, but then it's like they can quote unquote become a a Christian but still do those 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 um acts. You know what I mean? Of, of wickedness. You know? Go ahead, bro. Yep. It says, And good, it says, Woe unto them that call evil good, and good evil, that put darkness for light, and light for darkness. Yeah. So that's, that, that's what, that's what's uh, uh, taking place. You know? Especially, like, like you know, like now, people are like, during this time of the year, think, oh, it's about family, and, and, and you know the uh, birth of baby Jesus, <laughs> baby Jesus, bro. The the the, the Lord he, he wasn't born on on no December the 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 the, the, the twenty fifth, man. You know, he sharp sure lies, bro. You know, he 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 he, he was born uh, uh, around spring, the uh, Passover time period. You know. The uh, the uh, scripture calls him what that a uh, lamb because he was born around that Passover man, you know, that's 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 some information that our um, uh, apostles have have spoken about that he he he's a representation of the Passover so he he was born around that time, you know. Do you have anything to to speak about, bro? Well, um, because I was just um thinking about like earlier like research as mm -hmm. well. Because, like, you would have, like, most, like, going back to, like, Rome, you mm -hmm. know, when people were celebrating Saturnalia and, and all those um, pagan, Festival. yeah, pagan festivals, right? They were celebrating them and, and it was, like, common among just common people. Mm. So they would actually, you know, like, in the church, it would actually be expected. People that went into the church, they would expect, you know, to be, you know, celebrating these um, uh, yeah. rituals, you yeah, know, yeah, and yeah, these yeah. types of things. So that's how it became more incorporated yeah. in the actual church. Yeah. 
you know so and that's like how you see people are today yeah, they, they yeah. just expect you yeah, to yeah, be yeah. in the spirit and then, yeah. of christmas man which is paganism yeah and then yeah 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 i understand, I understand what you're saying it's like they 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 still kind of like adopted those uh uh uh, 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 uh pagan deductions to just convert people that were still in that kind of, of paganistic lifestyle right. you know and it's the same thing now like if you have a so-called jake church that still lets people smoke weed and eat pork well, well, well that's what christianity is 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 uh now if you think about it you know it's just like you know like you know you know you, you, now people say come as uh, you, you, you are, you know, a, a person yeah. will could come into a church and still be a drug dealer, still be a faggot, yep. but you know, he's Christian, you know, he's God's child, my son, he's God's, he's child, God's child, but he's, a, but he's a freak, you know, yeah, to each his own, you to know? each his own, that's and all what that they shit. say, man, yeah, but that's what calling um, evil uh, good, yeah, you know, putting light for, for darkness, yeah, darkness for light. And it says that put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Mm. Yeah, because in because 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 in you know so called a, a Christmas, even just speaking on this point, like people really think that oh it's Jesus' birthday, bro. He wasn't born around this time. He was born around spring. And if you go into to, to the research of what was going on, it had nothing to it's nothing to do with the Bible. You know, just did, and, and and even the Christmas tree, the scripture speaks of, speaks against that in Jeremiah ten, which you know, just if you quickly just read this and then we can read that. Right. So your yeah, BibleTools.org, right, and it says what the Bible says about Christmas tree, and it says, uh, uh yeah, just get, uh, yeah, that's yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah. So it says evergreen trees were important fertility emblems. For pre-Christian ceremonies marking the winter solstice. Yeah, because also as well as the worship of the uh, the uh, winter solstice, man. All right, go ahead. It says people from ancient societies believed that by decorating their homes and temples with evergreen plants such as holly, ivy, and mistletoe, they were helping to carry the diminished sun through a critical period. Yeah, the, 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 that's why it's called um, Sol Sol Invictus. You know, basically the, the the sun's not the the sun is unconquered. You know, go ahead. Sorry, and it sorry. says, I can't look at that. Yeah, that's cool. That's cool. It says because now now it says mistletoe was the most sacred plant of the Druids. It was given great reverence. Because it grows on the on the venerated oak. Yeah. The custom of kissing under the mistletoe comes from the ancient idea that mistletoe is the oak's genitals. Mm. Go ahead. It says, and so it was believed that an embrace. Mm. Yep. It says that an embrace under its glistening berries was sure. Guarantee of a fruitful union. Yeah, so, 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 so that's why now, so, so, that's what uh, people do. You know, especially at work, they come, come, you know people come come with it. Oh yeah. You know the uh, mistletoe all over you know a person's head and say, uh, "Come let's kiss." People don't know. You know, people just 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 be doing things and not knowing where it's coming from. You know. Uh, let's. Let's uh, yeah, skip there, then. right? That uh, reading down it says two key figures in the origin of Christmas are Nimrod, a great grandson of Noah, and his mother and wife Semiramis, also known as Ishtar and Isis. Yeah, which uh, Easter is uh, Ishtar is the same thing, you know. That's why when, when the scripture speaks about Easter, it's really the Passover. You know? Go ahead, bro. It says, Nimrod, known in Egypt as Osiris, was the founder of the first world 
Empire at, at Babel, later known as Babylon, from ancient sources such as the Epic of Gilgamesh. No, let's, yeah, let's, let's, let's skip down there. All right, reading on down, it says, After Nimrod's death, Ceramesis promoted the belief that he was a god. She claimed that she saw a full-grown evergreen tree spring out of the roots of a dead tree stump. Yeah, so that's where it comes from. And it's also, if you go into other information, it speaks about, it's, it's also a representation of his penis, you know? So, 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 so people having this Christmas tree in this house, it's Nimrod's dick, <laughs> you know? Okay, bro. And it says, uh, symbolizing the springing forth of new life for Nimrod. On the anniversary of his birth, she said Nimrod would visit that evergreen uh, tree and leave gifts under it. His birthday fell on the winter solstice at the end of December. Yeah, man. So, 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 so all this and this all, you know, this, this, uh, 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 this, uh, and, and then it also speaks about, about what? <laughs> That's an alien, you know, if you, if you skip here. Yep. Yeah. Right. So it says, reading down, it says, when they saw the length of the day increasing, they celebrated by riotous, unrestrained feasting and orgies. This celebration See, for, for feasting and, 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 and orgies, man. You know, so, so 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 like now people talk about that spirit of oh that that oh yeah, but it's not the spirit of Christmas. Well, the spirit of of of, of Christmas is being a freak. You know, freak. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, uh, just indulging in loads of food and to the point people would, would uh, puke. Yeah, glutton, gluttony, man. Yeah, yeah you know. Um, lawless. Yeah. You know? Yeah, you see, that's what these people do now as well. That's exactly what they do. You know, they use it as a time to, you know, just be undisciplined, you know, given to the uh, lust of the flesh, you know. And, and the scriptures speak about the lust of the flesh, man, you know. That, that's all going to pass away, man. All these customs, you know, they're, they're vain, right? And they have roots in, in paganism and wickedness, you know, so the Lord's not with it. Mm -hmm. All right, um, so it says, This celebration, known as Saturnalia, was named after Saturn, another name for Nimrod. Yeah, so it's, 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 it's all this, these, these false paganist, you know, gods, man. Which you know, if you read in Jeremiah ten, it speaks about the uh, the basically the the, the the Christmas tree and how we're supposed to be in a, that 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 way, you know, which is a heathenistic way. Go ahead. Yep. This is Jeremiah chapter ten and verse one. Hear ye the word which the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Shai speaketh unto you, O house of Israel. Thus saith the Lord, Learn not the way of the heathen. And be not dismayed at the signs of heaven, for the heathen are dismayed at them. Yeah, 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 man. So you know, you know, like a prime example of, 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 of what we're talking about. This is a like, like a like, like a heathenistic uh, kind of custom, man. You know, the, you know these people like the uh, sun gives light, so so. So these people go on, go go, go on and 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 worship the uh, sun, and not the power who who made the sun, you know. This is all it's all paganism, witchcraft. But that scripture says we ain't supposed to be in that way, man. You know now, you know again, apostles have said you know before if you got you know if you got some family members that are, are in the world that might cook some some food, hey, just pray over it. And eat, man. Don't, 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 don't go, to, don't, don't, don't come into the house on Christmas and curse everyone out. Hey, man, you guys are going off, man. Cause it's pay. No, no, you have to be wise as a serpent. But it's just good to know where this comes from. You know. Yeah, and if I can just uh, say as well on the point, because you know, um, you know, going back to the whole uh, winter solstice, you know, the times when. Um, you know, you know, in the winter times, you know, you'll have different types of things happening in, in, the, in the heavens, man. Mm -hmm. You know, whether it be, um, you know, a, a solar eclipse or whether you'll have, you know, comets shooting stars or, or such things, 
maybe even chariots, you, you know, these heathens, you know, they get dismayed at that, at that sight, man, mm -hmm. you know, but us, you know, we're not supposed to be dismayed. We know what these things are, man. We worship the true living power, man. Yeah, how about Shmi, how shy, mm -hmm. you know, but these heathens, you know, the Lord's not dealing with them. So we're not supposed to be following after their ways, you know, their customs, right? Now, uh, continue on. Yeah. So it says, verse 3, it says, For the customs of the people are vain. Yeah, it's really vain, bro. It's, it's bro, it's wicked and it's, it's unprofitable. Mm -hmm. Like, even now, like, think about it. You actually have a nine-foot Christmas tree in your yard. For what reason? Even, like, like you know, as we see across yeah, the road. Yeah. Like, well, come on, man. Go ahead, bro. It says... For one cutteth a tree out of the forest. You see? An evergreen tree. Because it stays, it stays, you know, basically it stays green all, all, all uh, year round. You know, like in uh, autumn, there's some trees that go brown and their leaves fall away. But well, this tree is green all year round. Right? It says, yeah, it says for... One cutteth a tree out of the forest, the work of the hands of the workman with the axe. Mm -hmm. You know, with their big axe, yeah. chopping out the tree, carrying it with them. Yeah. You know, you see people selling them trees and yeah, all yeah. over the streets, man. Yeah, yeah. That's the same thing they're doing. Yeah. But, uh, uh, and that's also a precept to, um, what's that scripture? Ecclesiastes 3, there's no new thing under the sun. Cool. Like, people are worshipping uh, pagan ideologies right to this day uh, and i don't even know that is the, is you know what i mean it's like people are celebrating ancient gods not knowing that is is they're, they're actually doing it you know or or, or worshiping an ancient feast not 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 knowing that you know because they're in darkness that's why when when, when the lord comes back that you know that's why the laws Statues and commandments are then going to be established on the earth, and people are going to realize that all this time, the, these things that th th they felt as oh, I'm just doing it for the kids, and all I'm doing this, you know, that it's all wickedness, man. Go ahead, bro. Yeah, it says verse four. They deck it with silver and with gold. That's what they do, man. That's what they do. That's what they do, yeah. bro. That's what, that's what a Christmas tree is. Like the tinsels. The, the, yeah, you know, those tinsels silver and stuff like that. With silver, gold, and tinsels. They're decorating it. It's decorated. Know? Yeah. You know? Ornaments and yeah, weird yeah. crap like that. They put, they put the star, the well, star on top. Yeah. Might have like uh, white looking angels, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. with wings, blonde hair. Yeah. yeah. Blue eyed angels on top yeah. of the trees and that. Yeah. Yeah. Like, come on, man. Come on, man. <laughs> like, the scriptures don't describe nothing like that. Yeah. But then if you tell people about to keep, keep the Passover, you know, yeah. or the Feast of Tabernacles, people are going to scoff. Oh, the times have passed. But you, but you people be be being be, 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 be celebrating uh, madness for a long time. Good. It says they deck it with silver and with gold, and they fasten it with nails and with hammers. That's a Christmas tree, bro. That mm -hmm. come on, bro. They cut a tree. They deck it with silver and gold. That's a Christmas tree. Go ahead. They're yeah, fastening it so it don't yeah. like move. Mm -hmm. It don't you know put in a corner somewhere. Yeah. So it don't blow over or some something. Yep. You know, it says, and and fasten it with nails and with hammers that it move not. They are upright as the palm tree, but speak not. They must needs be born because they cannot go. Be not afraid of them, for they cannot do evil. Neither also is it in them to do good. Yeah, man. So, you know, it's, it's, it's just off, man. It's just off. Right? Um, You know, with that, I've got a... Uh, a short, um, short clip. A thousand miles away in Rome, winter was less harrowing, but the December festivals were just as elaborate. One week before the winter solstice, Romans began celebrating Saturnalia, a month-long orgy of food and drink. Named for the god Saturn, which meant plenty, Rome's established order was turned on its head during this wild, delirious time. See, so it, 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 it was actually a wild time. 
you know, of just of just wickedness, man. The dog having sex in the streets and orgies, sacrifices, and then if you go into the information on Wikipedia, as well during that 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 that, that a week if a person was a slave, for that week the the slave would, would become the master and the master is slave. But I believe on the uh, last day of the feast, that that a person would, would would get stuffed with food all day, who have all his pleasures. And on that that last day, who gets get sacrificed, you know? You see, so that's how you know, man. The Saturnalia celebrations were certainly times of revelry, of of turning the social order upside down, of having the master pretend to be the slave and the slave pretend to be the master. Sort of a time out of time, in which one could celebrate a, a kind of a, a disorder in the universe. One of the holiday's important feasts was Juvenalia, which celebrated the children of Rome. Although these early festivals are not necessarily about children, um, but it's the upper classes in Rome, these ribald, drunken festivals that the Romans had. Among the upper classes in Rome, solstice celebrations were significantly more sober. Many influential Romans worshipped Mithra, the god of the unconquerable sun. To this small but powerful... Yeah, and then again, the, the word Sol Invictus means uh, uh, unconquered sun, man, you know? Sect, the birthday of Mithra was the holiest day of the year. December 25th was the winter solstice in that part of the world. And it was also understood to be the birthday of the sun god, Mithra. And Mithra was said to be born from a rock. Shepherds came to... You see? It's just, it's just all, 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 all a bunch of madness, man. You know? The, uh, Lord, Lord, the, the, Lord, the Lord was born around spring, man. All right? He, 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 you know, because the Passover was around, uh, uh, around spring. And as our apostles mentioned before, the Passover was a representation of him. He, he, he is that lamb. So he was born around spring. He, you know, he, you know, the apostles said before, he was born in the Passover, man. You know, so so all of that 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 way of life and doctrine, this is it's all madness, man. Do you have something, bro? I, I got a precept for you. Yeah. This is uh, Psalms ninety six, and verse five. Uh, I'll start from four. It says, "For the Lord Yahweh, Ba Hashem Shai, is great and greatly to be praised. He is to be feared above all gods, mm -hmm. for all the gods of the nations are idols." Yeah, man. So 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 you know. Like all these nations have their own gods and customs, but it's all idols, man. And so, 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 so some of the, the uh, uh, customs people keep, uh, you, you know, you, f f f for today, it's, 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 it's not even in the scriptures, you know. Prime example is this, you know, the, you know, saying, you know, you have to 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 uh, to to. to, to do, to, to go uh, celebrate the Lord's birthday when they ain't a scripture on that. Mm -hmm. You know, even the, 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 the celebration of birthdays isn't necessarily an Israelite uh, kind of custom. You know, I think, you know, the main times in the scriptures is mentioned birthdays, what? Um, Joseph, time of yeah. Joseph, uh, when, you know, you remember when he was in, in, in prison and it yeah. was yeah. the Pharaoh's birthday, I believe. You know, and he had the the baker and the butler, and then also um, you, you had a uh, Herod, uh, yeah. uh, like on his birthday, and that's when um, his uh, his 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 uh, daughter or, or or his wife's daughter, you know, asked for the <laughs> head of of John the Baptist. You know, remember when his daughter came and danced, you know, before him and that. You know, and, and and basically his 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 a uh, wife, which was 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 actually the 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 uh, what the the actual wife of his uh brother that he had took. You know, basically it was adulterous, and John the Baptist was cursing him out, man. But basically on his birthday, it, like is when he was killed, man. So when you go into scriptures and you know that whole whole custom of birthdays and 
You know, it's 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 not really like a custom of ours. Just the same thing as, as Christmas, the same thing as Easter. You know, but like those those righteous holy days, right? Are they in the scriptures? The Passover, Feast of Tabernacles, Pent, you know, first fruits, Feast of Weeks, Purim. Exactly, yeah. we, we which give, is a t- which is a time. Go on, yeah, we, yeah, we give gifts for Purim as well. Which which is it? Which is a righteous, high, holy day that we have, man. Yeah, you know, but you know, try and tell that to our people in yeah. the churches. They don't want to get down with that. They want to do that. No, it's Christmas. Christmas. You know, this that's what they they're about, man. But hey, the scriptures say my people are destroyed for for, for, for a lack, lack of knowledge. For a lack of knowledge. And seeing as they reject this word, the Lord's gonna reject them. Mm. You know, and their children, man. So, yeah. hey, the scriptures say what the. The, um, what the congregation of the dead? Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. they that wander out of the way of understanding, but remain, remain, remain in the congregation, congregation of the dead. dead. That's where most of our people are at, man. That don't have this this truth. They're they're, they're in a dead state, man. Spirit, yeah, spiritually dead, man. You know, the scriptures also speaks about, oh, you know, they, they uh, what's that one? They are uh, no, not they stumble in darkness. All the foundations, all the foundations are fire, of course. Yeah. Can, can, can you finish that and get that? Yeah. The last bit on this it says, "For all the gods of the nations are idols, but the Lord made the heavens." Yeah, man. You know, so so really, the 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 the, the only true power is how about Shem? How about Shai, man? That's that's the the, the 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 real true true uh, power, and uh, and like his uh, special days, his days, you know, and such things that that she mentioned in the scriptures. Those those righteous feasts, you know. I got that scripture for you. Yeah, good, bro. Yeah, this is Psalms eighty-two and verse five. It says, "They know not, neither will they understand. They walk on in darkness." Yeah, everyone's wa- everyone's walking in darkness, and even even on this this uh this this topic to 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 to, to bring it to this time period now, like. Uh, Everyone's in that, that Christmas spirit when, you know, there's lockdowns, you know, mm, yeah. you know, food shortages. They're actually telling you Christmas you might get, get kind, of, kind of canceled this year or Christmas is going to be more expensive or food shortages. You've got gas prices rising like 50 percent. Yeah. You know, high percentages. Man. Yeah. 50 percent, 55 percent from the start of the year, you know. So this is clearly not the time of month for people are still trying to make it work. Like, bro, you know, obviously we're here doing the video. If you look across the road, man, it's it's like that's like there's nothing. If you see his house, someone will think, man, man, there's nothing going on in our life. You know what yeah. I mean? He's just chilling. You know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah. Them lights. Go ahead, bro. It says. Uh, neither will they understand they walk on in darkness and all the foundations of the earth are out of course yeah man the people are out of course the minds that you know the the times the times itself the the the, the uh, years you know the food the you know the doctrine pe- you know everything is out of course man wickedness is has is spring spring up upon, upon the earth man that's why um what's that Isaiah 29 16 surely you know that that's why you know as 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 as, as uh, the uh, lord comes back you know from 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 us now preaching up until till he returns everything is getting turned upside down man you know you know sorry he's getting turned right side up and it's starting off with this truth because we're pulling down the uh, strongholds right but guess what you know even though we're, we're doing that Ultimately speaking, when the Lord comes back on earth, that's when the, the, the you know basically everything will, will be will be established for how it's supposed to be. You know, go ahead. Preset. This is Habakkuk two and verse fourteen. For the earth shall be filled with the knowledge of the glory of the Lord. Yeah, and it's starting now. It's starting now. So that's why this 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 uh, this word is everywhere. The truth is the truth is everywhere, you know, you, you know. But but but, but 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 again, you know, like ultimately speaking, when 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 the Lord comes back with His chariots and we come down from from them and start establishing that everything will be established upon His earth, man. 
and oh, as the scripture says in Isaiah two, that all 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 nations gonna come to us, to to you know come to teach us of of your ways and such things. But yep, for the earth shall be filled with the knowledge of the glory of the Lord Yahweh Bashmi Shai, as the waters cover the sea. Mm. That's yeah. deep. God is speaking. It. Yeah, because you know hey, when the Lord does establish the kingdom on the earth, right? You know, you're going to have the laws, statutes and commandments that are going to be established as well. They're going to be followed. You know, you know, you're not going to have any of these, um, you know, pagan customs. You know, the scriptures talk about when the Lord, um, you know, comes, he's going to pluck out all things that offend. Mm -hmm. You know, so right, you know, right now we got all these, um, you know, uh, pagan practices being done in the earth. Right. But soon that's going to be done away with, you know, mm -hmm. um, you got, uh, what was I going to say? You know, like, because cause basically you got the wicked ruling right now. So, yeah, that's what I was going to say. Uh, the scriptures talk about when when, when, when the wicked rule, transgression, transgression increases. Transgression increases. That's that one as well. But also, you know, the scriptures say that, um, uh, like, judgment uh, never goes forth. The judgment never goes forth. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The law is slacked. The, the law yeah. is slacked. Yeah. yeah, the law is slacked, man. Therefore, the wrong judgment proceedeth but when the lord returns you know hey the correct judgment is going to be done but the lord's going to rebuke these nations man you yeah. know with those chariots as well you know the fire coming down you know and everything is going to be made new man refreshed the lord's going to create new heavens and a new earth man where dwells righteousness and the scripture speaks about in a I think is i think is wisdom the truth which is so long so long no no ezra's i think so so, so long without fruit shall be declared it is it's being declared now but ultimately when when the kingdom is established everyone's gonna have to bow down every knee shall bow and tongue confess that yeah how shy is lord man right you have anything else bro you know, yeah we're gonna make this too long we really made the point it's paganism man i've got two, two. and you know it's, it's just, this information is not hard to find out that you can just type it in it's Christian, uh, it's Christmas, uh, is it paganism? And you'll find a lot of information on it. Go ahead, bro. I've got two scriptures for you. This is James 4 and 4. Ye adulterers and adulteresses, know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with the Most High? Yeah, and even, you know, again, you know, if you've got, got family members that, that do it, don't, you know, go go to the Christmas and curse them out. So we've been told by apostles, you know, if, if, if they get, if they serve you a plate of, of of lawful food, just pray over it and eat. But like in your mind, you will know that whole Christmas spirit is of the world, man. You know that the, the Christmas tree, the Christmas jumpers, the the, the pigs in blankets. So so that's pig covered in bacon. You know, you know what I mean. The gammon, the, with yeah, the honey glaze. Yeah, the, yeah. <laughs> pork and it's got a. Apple in his mouth. Oh, you know that's that's all paganism, man. That's all witchcraft. Yeah, it's wicked, man. You know. Okay. Yep. And it says, "Whosoever therefore will be a friend of the world is the enemy of the Most High." Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Exactly, man. That's why we have to be uh, uh, separate. You know, we have to be be, be uh, separate. That's why, you know, I'm sure, the, the, you know, the, the uh, 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 anyone who's Truly, in his truth, it hasn't got that that Christmas spirit. So you you know you know to us it's another day. Yeah, it's another day. Good. Yep. Uh, got one more for you. This is Second Ezra six and twenty eight. As for faith, it shall flourish. Corruption shall be overcome, and the truth which have been so long without fruit shall be declared. Yeah, and it's starting off now. You know, you know the you know this 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 uh truth. It's pulling down these these uh, strongholds, man. You know this uh, corrupt way is being condemned, but 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 ultimately when you know this this mortal puts on like uh, 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 immortality, when we're changed, and when we're rulership, this 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 basically uh, everything that we've taught is gonna is gonna come to pass. You know us like. Teaching about the um, Lord coming back. One day it's going to be declared and manifested before everyone that He's here. And then from that point, everything's going to 
from that point be 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 be, be uh, beat down and and true true truth and true order is going to be established on the earth man have anything to say bro uh, i think that's it man kind man so we just want to do a quick quick video you know on this this whole spirit of christmas you know it's really straightforward man the, the you know the 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 whole idea of Christ, of the christmas tree goes back to a, a, a nimrod you know if you go into other information speaks about it being his rod you know so it's the penis of of, of a, a nimrod and his mum that shows you he's crazy man he, he, he was popular as a mum man mm. <laughs> his mum slash wife and then oh. oh, 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 after he died she, she, she was uh she, 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 she was she was she was pregnant you know magically come on man anyway man with that we're gonna say all praises really to Yahweh, Basham, Yahweh Shai, Basham, Rakal Kodash. The bonus puzzles and elders will be a monster. Next time we're gonna say, shut up, one.